Uh, good morning, Uncle Lou here. Uh, yeah, now, first of all, let me let me start uh, with a disclaimer here, uh, uh, a little truth in advertising. I have I have defended Greg McGarity uh, on a number of occasions uh, in 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 different circumstances over the last couple of years. Um, I'm not going to get into all all those things, but you know, just like. Uh, I defended Mark Richt for a long time too. So, you know, but everyone has a tipping point or, or a breaking point, whatever. Uh, and that, that, that point is fast approaching, uh, in terms of Uncle Lou, uh, and my support for Greg McGarity. Now, to be clear, I could care less whether there's a concert before the G Day game or not. I, I really don't care. Uh, and, and any fans that, we're only going to the game because there was a 15 minute or 20 minute concert at the G Day game during warm ups. I, I mean, I, I don't know what, I, I'm not sure what your thinking was there. If, if, you know, if, if that was your deciding factor in going to the game was to see an unnamed band perform for 15 minutes uh, while, G, while UGA was doing jumping jacks, I'm not sure what's wrong with you there. But here's the problem. Here, here's where McGarity... I, I mean, th th this is just a, an epic fail uh, of biblical proportions. You, you do not, under any circumstances, come out and announce some sort of plan that you have before you have any sort of plan! This is common sense! I, I, I mean, mind... Blown! I mean, the, 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 the UGA, the more time that goes by here, the UGA administration is really starting to look like the gang that can't shoot straight. Why in the world would you come out and announce some sort of plans or, or whatever for pregame entertainment, a concert, anything, when, when you don't have at least something lined up. I, I, I mean, talk about putting the, the cart before the horse here, uh, or the horse before the cart, whatever, I don't, whatever. You, you get what I'm trying to say here. Uh, I mean, th th it, there's a step one and a step two. Step one, secure some sort of deal. Step two, announce the deal. You don't come out and say, we're going to do A, B, and C, and you haven't done diddly squat. To, to line any of that up. That, that's incompetence uh, of the highest order, sir. Well, what, what in the world? I mean, th this is just, th this is beyond the pale. Uh, th th this is, first of all, it, it's humiliating for the UJ Athletic Department. I don't care. Look, uh, fans of other teams or whatever, any jokes or whatever you want to make about, I don't blame you. I do not. It, UJ fans, if this happened at any other school, uh, you would be in the line uh, to throw jabs at that school for this. Th th this is absolutely ridiculous. Uh, just ridiculous and unnecessary. There is more excitement surrounding this year's G-Day game than any G-Day game I can remember in years past. D definitely over the last 15 years. There was no reason to even ha have a pregame concert or entertain or whatever it was you were calling it. There was no need for that. That's something that should have been done two years ago, three years ago, five years ago, when there was 20 and 30,000 people showing up at the G-Day game. The excitement and the anticipation for this year's G-Day game is already through the roof because of Kirby Smart and Jacob Eason. There was no need to do this. None. And all you've done is make yourself look like a bumbling idiot, sir. You have egg on your face. The entire UGA, th this is a black eye for the entire UGA administration, and it was unnecessary. I mean, uh, this isn't like getting y y your, your, your brakes beat off by Al Alabama at home last year. You, you didn't have a choice. You had to play Alabama last year. We had to. We didn't have a choice. 
Yes, it was embarrassing, but we had to do it. This was completely unnecessary. There was no reason to ever do this to start with. And then on top of that, you can't close the deal! What? Oh my God! Jesus Christ!